Jeez. Oh, I'm surprised there's a couple openings here at the bar. Even the damn tables are just about filled up. Ugh. Sorry, love. I wasn't expecting it to be so busy. Uh, I think I overheard something about a concert just getting out. You know, who in the hell has concerts on a Wednesday night? Well, you let me know if it gets to be too much, okay? And I will gladly take you home. <laughs> I mean, if you want to go now, I can make it worth your while. <laughs> no, no. Well, I told you I would bring you here. And that we were going to celebrate. And since we can't actually celebrate on your birthday, you know, because our job schedules suck. I want to do whatever it is you want to do. <laughs> Besides, I love watching you get sloppy drunk. <laughs> You're so cute. <laughs> oh, hon. You're turning red. And you haven't even had a drink yet. Speaking of which, pick your poison. Alright, I'll pick us up around 1am. So, we have until then to do whatever it is your heart desires. And, if I'm lucky, maybe something my heart desires. Hmm? <laughs> Ow! Oh, babe, don't punch me. Besides, you wouldn't want to get me all excited now, would you? <laughs> yeah, I'll have a rum and coke. And put whatever the lady wants on my tab. Whatever you want, babe. It's yours. Happy early birthday, my love. Seriously, I love you. You look absolutely stunning tonight. I am so lucky to have you. And I hope you have a really good night tonight. <laughs> Cheers! You know, the only proper way to toast something like this is with a shot of- Ay! Hey! Hey! Oh, watch it! Ugh. Oh, a good third of my drink is all over my lap now. Ugh. God, I hate it when these bars are crowded like this. Well, at least he didn't knock into your drink by the looks of it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I get protective of my alcohol, thank you very much. Going out drinking is expensive as hell, and the last thing I want is some drunk asshole spilling it all over me. The only thing I'm more protective about is this really cute girl sitting next to me. <sighs> Shut up, you dork. You know I mean you. Oh, thank God. The jukebox is done playing that wailing, whiny music. I'm gonna go put some money in and stop the heartbroken dude at the corner from playing any more... She left me, she took my dog and my truck shit. I'll be right back. Hey, 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 what the fuck? Hey, what are you doing? Are you hitting on her? Look, I heard her tell you to leave her alone. What do you mean, who am I? It's none of your fucking business who I am. The lady asked you to leave her alone, and yet you still insist on bothering her. <sighs> Typical douche. Let me guess. Your name's Kevin, right? Or is it Chad? Yeah, you look like one of them. Dude, seriously. Leave her the fuck alone. How do I know she's not interested? <laughs> Come on, man. Everyone and their brother heard her tell you to back off. And besides, she's 
mine. Come on, babe. Let me ignore this douchebag. We're going to have fun, and I am not going to let anyone spoil our night. And if I have to stand here between you and creepy fuckheads all night, well, I'm more than happy to be your knight in shining armor. Excuse me? Oh, so you're pissed you can't get a pretty girl like her, and I can. So, instead of just slinking away with your tail tucked between your legs like a good boy, you feel the need to call us various homophobic slurs. Ah, yeah, really showing your maturity level there, bro. Ugh, whatever. Oh, babe, you got me a shot? Oh, you're the best. Are you trying to get me to defend your honor, my lady? Well, because you know, I don't need booze to do that. <laughs> well, my princess, as your knight in shining armor, it is my honor to defend you. <laughs> don't fucking touch her again. Jesus Christ, you fuckhead. Back off. She's not interested. And I am sure you would hate it if I kicked your ass here in front of everybody. <laughs> yeah, that's what I thought. Dude, do not touch me. And I swear to God. God, if you reach for her again, <sighs> you fucker. Mm. Ow. Oof. Mm. <sighs> Oof. <laughs> mm. No, babe. <sighs> Stay back. This guy's come. Completely bombed. Oh, one more punch ought to do it. Oh, and I hope it does. It feels like the fucker already broke my nose. My eyes are watering so bad I can barely see. Come, come on, babe. Let's get out of here. Love, listen, I'm... I'm sorry that the night turned out this way. I wish people would have just minded their own fucking business. We were having a great time and then, well, instead of ignoring that douche, I escalated it. It wasn't fair to you. But, on the flip side, he was being really aggressive. And he wouldn't take no for an answer. Honestly, I was... I was scared. I was scared he would have hurt you. Scared of what he could and might have done to you. He was a big guy and... Honestly, the two of us are pretty small. You should be here even more so. I don't know what I would do if something happened to you. God, being heartbroken doesn't even begin to describe what I would feel. I love you so, so much. I... I... I couldn't live with myself if I allowed someone to hurt you. You're my everything. But... There were other ways I could have handled that. Ways that wouldn't have ruined the rest of your night. Wait. What do you mean I didn't ruin it? 
babe, I punched a dude, probably have a busted nose, and we got kicked out of the bar. Now we're on our way home way too early on the night you were supposed to celebrate. How did I not ruin everything? <laughs> oh, oh, you like that I punched a guy out for you. That I defended your honor. <laughs> babe. Babe, are you really into that whole knight in shining armor rescuing the helpless princess thing? <laughs> oh shit, hun. If I would have known that, I would have been punching out guys left and right. <laughs> so, my lady, you know we don't have to go straight home. Your knight will accompany her fair maiden anywhere she wishes to go. You... you want to go home? Oh, to patch up my wounds. So, we're going from princess to nurse? Or is it a combination of both? <laughs> How did I end up getting so lucky to have someone as wonderful as you in my life? I really, really love you. So, so much. Well, this wasn't the way I expected the night to go, but I am still glad to be able to spend it with you. I love you.